let's talk first. Not here for the loot. Interested in the sorceress who lived here. And we're supposed to believe that. Yeah. Most likely I did in some rat trap with the rest of them. Mm. Who's she hiding from? Temple Gods cracking down. All mages are fair game. Yeah, they round them up like rats. Someone's got to know more. I'd look for her in a putrid grove. Putrid grove. Where is it? I wouldn't know. Rumor has it, it's a place for freaks and oddities. You'd fit in well there. Maybe. Thing is, gotta know how to get there. They say you've got to get there through the sewers, but you've got to enter them outside of town. Few know where exactly, though. Ask a beggar. Or spot yourself a thief. Follow in. Beggars and thieves gotta pay tribute to the king of beggars. Word is, they do it in the grove. Mean to say the local beggars have a king? Crown, scepter, and all that. Wouldn't <laughs> scoff, mate. King of beggars, it's a moniker. Yeah, for a man who everyone in Novigrad respects deeply. And watch yourself. Menger himself don't even go to the grove. Someone call for me. Wonder why. This Menger. Temple God. Hmm. Thieving vermin to the confession chamber. What, but sir, what's the offence? This is some sorcerer's bitchy shop. Think that gives you the right to steal her property? Well, sorcerers, majors of all types, are outlaws. But by law, the temple guard takes possession of their belongings. And the rule of law still holds in Novigrad. Do I have a say in this? Mm, I hope not. I mean, they were thieves. So. You know a bat can sniff out a moth a mile away. Mm. Yeah, what do you want? What's your point? I ask the questions, Witcher. And I don't if bats sense moths, so I sense freaks. And start by warning them. Novigrad's no place for your kind. I don't care. Fuck you. Mm. Heard Novigrad was no place for mages. Now you're telling me it's no place for witchers. So who's it a place for? Righteous folk professing the one true faith in the eternal fire. Nothing I can do to you now. But just know that I know you're here. One misstep, one error. You'll make a mistake, it's inevitable. And you will die. I'll be the first to learn of it. And when I do, it'll be standard procedure. Like for every magic oddity who dares taint this city's air. Be seeing you. Yeah, I hope so. So I can kill you. Fucking bastard. I mean, I guess to understand it's not their fault. Being manipulated by their faith. Thieves. So that's why I saw that other guy. Oh, deepest apologies, Governor. Fetch some metal, you wretch. I've been robbed! Thief! I saw them. The fucking thieves everywhere. I don't know what the hell I call. He 
sensed something. Gotta stay further back. Give us a crown, eh? My mum's sick, and if I don't feed her, well, she's like to die hunger. Sure. All right, I'll give you some coin, but you gotta tell me where the putrid grove is. I don't know that. Keep your coin, I don't... Hmm. I'm following him. Question is, what's going to happen? Who do I follow? I go with the guy who has the money. Because otherwise, like he's the one who's going to pay tip it. I want to meet Twist. Channel 5, please. Fucking pass. Go. Be gone. Jeddars. The dark hole of civilization. More cautious than I thought. Can't get too close. He might just be leading me astray if he knows where I am. Just threw it in there. Open up. Who are you and what you want? Take a look. What do you see? Yellow eyes, pair of swords, mutated kill at me things. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. Heard right. Know the password, get him free. Don't know him. Got to contribute to the Grove's upkeep. Damn, don't I don't know the password. Pay up then. What do you pay? Level two. Might be a pro. Then come back. I can't remember what level I had it on. But. Didn't look like I have it high enough. Damn it. Damn it! Level 2. 
Ah, it's only 50 coins, for fuck's sake. Huh? Heard this place. Heard right. Don't know the password. Could probably get it to know by some of the beggars, but. Who cares? It's just 50 Catch. fucking. Hmm. You may enter. Oh, right after you leave me. Hmm. Fine. Fine. Make sure you don't lose them. No worries. Be waiting for you once you're done with the king. Well, I'm gonna track you down and kill you. That's what. That's what's gonna happen. Hmm. Nice view. Okay, no more walking. What ails you? So that one I actually picked him by the way. Bloody hell! That's those names from the city council that stole the money. Go ahead. More. Ah, this was. We made something clear, sorceress. Yes, high time. Me and my men will manage just fine without the help of you or any other mages. But you, well, without our help, you'll sit in dust on a temple guard. Who do I spy? Geralt? Atris. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. I was curious whether you managed to find me, Witcher. Spies tell you I was looking for the putrid grove. My skull would be a home for bottom feeding river fish if I didn't keep an ear to the ground. And please, putrid grove, ugly name for our cozy little hideout, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Temple guard tolerate your little operation. Let's say they appreciate the value. Of a Novigrad crown. Hmm. Manga doesn't seem like the type that can be bought. Anyone can be bought. But like is true, Manga had cost me a fortune. Luckily, he's got officers, and they're mere mortals. Illnesses catch him at times. Other times, they want to catch a bit of diversion. See, Witcher? I've got plans. Big plans. Far-reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Good, I'm in. Seeking a seat on the city council. City council is a puppet troop with a hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is, when Radovid and his witch hunters took the reins. The semblance of power don't interest me. A man with a vision. One day, the so-called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition, farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Yep. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mostly adults. Any crowd a rabble will cheer to the stench of burning flesh. But one day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. Exactly. They call this place the Putrid Grove, but it's the rest of Novigrad that's putrefied. This year's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. I'm actually glad someone like you's found his way to our city, because it will be our city one day, Geralt. Mark my words. Hmm. Yours, Laurel. Yeah, mine. And my friends. But that's a tale for another time. Hmm. For now, I'll leave you two alone. Because like I can see, well, you clearly need it. Gerald, I have a lot of things to take care of in town. I'll be glad to tag along. What's your arrangement? Are you using you? Helping me to survive, actually. 
Six months ago, if somebody said Triss Marigold would be working for a Novigrad criminal, I'd never have believed it. Six months ago, Triss Marigold parted with someone very dear to her and had to start a new. Hasn't turned out like I imagined. Madam Sorceress. Beautiful as ever. Damn shame to part. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. Nice to hear a few kind words, but my friend needs his weapons. Of course, I got them. Said I'd have them and give them back. So I'm giving them back. Here's your junk. Hey, you an idiot. Thanks. I have fucking quality. You watch out for yourself, please. Novigrad's not what it used to be. Not a city for you. I take it you're a Novigrad on important business. Yeah. Important doesn't do it justice. I'm looking for someone. More precisely? Young woman who's like a daughter to me. Her? Here? No, impossible. She was here. There are witnesses, evidence. Was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can, of course. Who might know more? And <laughs> then she walks. Well? Oh, I don't know. I guess she wants to go somewhere else. Seems to be a lot. Where's she? And this is a place where I feel I can make a difference, and I'm definitely gonna do it. Hello, Clue. Managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes. Somewhat with uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but I felt a cold sweat on my arms. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to! When asked why, I claimed it contained a dead cat. You shan't believe this, but they believe me. I need that package, Clue. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. I'm sure it'll turn up if you search. You expect me to pay you, then dive for my goods into that ice-cold filth? Uh, I'll get her. I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heel. Every man's got his sensitive spots. Interrogated a mage once. Pain couldn't touch him. Chew up his fingernails, crushed his bollocks. Nothing. Turned out he was devilishly ticklish. I placed the beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Damn, you went mad. You were lucky this time, but you'd best leave via the sewers. The trapdoor's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Clue. <laughs> That's a funny thing about the mage. Seems that I have to stop streaming now. My time's up. Anyways, well. <laughs> that's all for now. Thank you all for watching and I hope you have a pleasant day.